Hello everyone. So in this video, we are going to see about the radio buttons. So let's get started. The radio class belongs to the material file. Used to select between a number of mutually exclusive values. When one radio button in a group is selected, the other radio buttons in the group cease to be selected. So coming to the constructors of radio class. It has three required properties. The value. The group value. And the unchanged function. Let's code it together. Better understanding. In the scaffold of the build function, let's set the body to a column, with main axis alignment, and the cross axis alignment, to center. The children of the column, are going to be, three rows, each containing, a radio widget, and a text widget respectively. The radio widget, basically takes the, required parameters. Let's set value, and the group value 1, for now. The radio widget basically is set true, if the value, and the group value, is same. Comma let's leave the, unchanged function, blank for now taking value as argument. Have a text widget, as label for the, radio button. Copy the row, and paste it, two times, for time being, and change the values, to two and three respectively. As all the, values and group value, are equal to each other, every radio is set true, so we should have, a variable, to make the radios function properly. And then, set the group value as, the value variable, in all three radios. And finally, create set state function inside the unchanged and set the value to the value variable in all the three radios. <laughs> 